Hi, we always like to have a great desktop when we're working on our computer. And this wallpaper just came in and I'm going to make a little variety tips and tricks uh, tutorial. As um, I like this wallpaper, I would like to, to keep it. And one of the things I always do is go to variety, look at where the source is and in desktopper.co you can actually just save it for future time. You will see that uh, it's already saved in here. Remove from Dropbox, so I've made an account in uh, Desktopper. And as you can see up here, it has been deleted now. So I have a Dropbox account on my computer. When I just click on there, the great wallpapers just come to my own Dropbox and I keep them there. I can back make backups and things like that. But um, that's one thing as tip. And secondly, I wanted to keep this wallpaper, but actually as a gray one. Now, if you right mouse click on variety icon and you go to preferences, by the way, I always, I uh, already customized my icon here. Maybe you see another icon, it's similar, but this is the one from Sardi. Um, um, well, that's not uh, the point. So go to the Sardi folders in the panel and then select it. That's not what I wanted to tell you. I wanted to tell you that I like it also often grayscaled. So as you can see, you can uh, apply certain filters and some of the filters are really CPU uh, heavy, but grayscaling is, is nothing, it's, it's quickly done. So you can keep it on and you will always keep getting uh, great wallpapers, but then grayscaled. I only want to have this one grayscaled, so without going to GIMP, I just press little button here. And then I say I'm going to keep this for future reference, for future wallpapers. So you press Ctrl H. And um, then you see that the hidden folders are gone here. I just scroll back, another tip maybe. If you go over the icon, you scroll up, then it's the previous picture, you scroll down. And then it's the next picture and scroll down is the next picture up and up so that's how it works now we're going to look for the hidden folder which is in config variety and then you have to find your wallpaper in here and it's in wallpaper here you see your your monkey and then you just put it on the side here Give it a nice name, not this one. This one is the gray one. So gray or monkey meditation or something, I don't know. And you put it with the rest of your wallpapers. That's uh, one of the tips or another tip I wanted to share with you. All right, have fun with variety. It's a great tool. It makes our desktop a little bit brighter, beautiful and eye candy.